Hello guys, today let's create a simple material in Unreal Engine. We often use it when loading games. Ok, let's start it. First, let's create a material. Blend mode, translucent, unlit, and to set it. Ok. Now, let's create a ring shape. First, add a text chord and then subtract 0.5 from it so that the UV center point is 0, 0. Then we add a distance between it and 0. Ok, we get a radial gradient circle. And we can subtract a value from it to control the size of the circle. So let's add a parameter and rename it to size. Default value is 0.3. Then we add an abs and take the absolute value of the output. Since the value of the central part is a negative value, so we can get a ring shape. Ok, let's add a smooth step to control the width of the ring. We don't need to change mean, just max. So let's add a parameter and rename it to width and the default value is 0.1 Ok, then we run it and 1 minus Now we get a ring shape Ok And let's create a rotation effect Copy the text card and subtract 0.5 but this time we use 0.5 subtract text chord and the brick channel we use arc tangent too fast also divide to pi then add a frag now we have its angle Actually, these nodes are included in the vector to radial value. We can find and copy it. Ok, let's keep going. Add a subtract. Use output subtract time frag. We take frag of time to get a 0 to 1 loop. So we can get a gradient rotation effect. Power it and the exponent is 5 multiplied by ring shape now we have a simple loading pattern ok let's make it multiple just add a tiling default value is 2 also we need a frag to show it ok let's finish this material save it and create a material instance and we can change its size, tiling and width the size can be larger maybe 0 0.4 and the width maybe 0 0.05 ok tiling is an integer so maybe 3 yes, it looks better Ok, let's use it to static mesh Yes, we can see the effect And also we can set material domain to user interface Generally, we will use it in UI Ok, that's all for this video, hope you enjoyed, bye